Hey guys, welcome back in our section two. In section two, we're gonna discuss about that system enumeration, user enumeration, and network enumeration. So let's start with that system enumerations command. So in system enumeration, uh, when we take access of that SSH or while during that enumerate, uh, like any server, so there are some commands which we have to check before any that escalation so it's for that system enumerations only so first is that host name so when we go uh, with this command that host name so we can see the actual uh, that host name of that server and the other informations about that system enumeration which is uname hyphen a where we can see uh, the actual version and uh, like uh, which bit operating system we are using let's say that 64 8664 gnu linux and it's kali 669 uh, 2024 18 and apart from that uname hyphen a we can use that gate and then proc our uh, whatsapp where we got uh like other informations like debian versions and gnu build for debian SMP, BIM, Dynamic, Kali, uh, these details. We can use uh, for more enumeration, which is gate, etc, and then issue. Where we can see uh, we are using that Kali uh, Linux rolling. So we can identify the actual version because right now I'm using that, uh, that uh, the GUI version of that Kali Linux, but if you are using or if you are going to enumerate any server, so you will get the different uh, version of like with this command. And we can use that ps and aux. So in ps aux, uh, we'll get that information about uh, that which service is running on which PID, that's mean our process ID, let's say that as been. Uh, that in it splash and uh, we'll get some that juicy information uh, in this uh, like Q terminal GVFS to metadata Bluetooth uh, some directory details uh, except desktop and XFM W4 so there are some uh, like lots of that juicy information so we have to collect uh, like more informations from this that system and if i want to uh, like collect only that root information so i just add uh, that pipe sign and then i use that grab command and then root so now i can uh, see only that root result let's say uh, that where run uh, that light dm and uh, other uh, services which running with only that root users so we can use that psox and slash grab 